how can we as black women better serve black men in talking about uh, mental health awareness? Because I know that we have different perspectives, but I've heard oftentimes that black men won't receive from a black woman, like right. you need to see a therapist or right. there's something going on. It's usually you get a lot of pushback. So mm -hmm. how can we better serve the men in our lives, whether it be significant yeah, others or family or friends? I feel like it just comes with, it comes back to self love. Like, you know, I feel like men, you know, whether you had your mom in your life or not, we uh we go off of what we see. You know, and I think a lot of humans do, but like it's uh you know, it's 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 live what you wanna teach, you know what I'm saying, become the change you wanna see. You know, like it, somebody might not hit, like might not receive you saying, Yo, you need to go to therapy, yo, you been blah, blah, blah. But if they see you're so at peace and you're on your routine and your patterns are just so positive and everything is flowing, they can't help but to peep game, you know? So sometimes it's like, channel that energy into yourself. Sometimes liberating that dude that you love so much is leaving, you know what I'm saying? And not leaving him spiritually, mentally, maybe physically, but it's like show him and more so yourself the routine and create those patterns that you won't have to think about anymore and you won't have to explain because they like they 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 only generate God, you know what I'm saying, intention. You know what I'm saying? Like if you're in if you're in your truth and you align and you move in the way you want to and you're doing the work and you're reconditioning yourself to be who you want to be, not who you've had to be due to circumstance, whether it's your dude, your little sister, your little brother or your mom or a friend people will notice that and I feel like that's so much more effective than being the person who sees and you know it's like like you know everything but you don't you're not able to apply it you know and I think that's kind of the gap of mental health it's like we all kind of know better you know, like we've been doing it wrong for a long time you know and I hate to say wrong because there's no wrong or right but we've been doing it the way we've known right. we at least now know there's other ways more effective ways more dimensional ways for us to come into our, our, our own, our truth. But now it's like, for me again, it goes back to my three years, acknowledge, accept the sin. Can we accept that we don't know everything? I see a lot of African American men, and oftentimes they have, some of them have their own therapists. They call it Alizé. Don Julio. They talk about good <laughs> right? Listen, it's important that our African American women support African American men. Sometimes, and I've heard this question come from ladies a lot, how can I best support? Number one, men don't like to be told what to do. Right? So don't tell them what to do. You can ask them about therapy, but more than anything, don't ask them. Go with them. Offer to go to therapy with them, and guess what? You would get a lot better response. My mom always, she never sent us to church. She took us, right? If you tell a guy, hey, you know what? You seem like you're going through some stuff. I want you to go somewhere with me. And it was like, where? Yeah? Well, where do you want to go? I got a friend I want to go. We can go holler at him and talk to him. You would get a lot better response <laughs> from and, and you're going to talk to him together. Right. And so I, I would just admonish you to do that. That's the largest mechanism of support mm -hmm. that you can ever ask of. We don't want to go to a therapist by ourselves. Right. No. Right? We just, because we feel alone, right. plus we feel like, you know, it's bogus anyway. Right. But if right. you go and you can support them through a therapeutic process, man, you, you got a guy for life there. Yeah.